Welcome back. It was 10 years ago today that the new Helen DeVos Children's Hospital opened. Since then, the 14 story, $286 million blue building on the hill has grown to become ranked as one of the top 50 children's hospitals in the U.S. 13 on your side, health reporter Val Lego shares one family's life saving story. New Year's Eve 2015. One Holly Monroe will never forget. And I kind of frantically yelled like, I have the heart baby. <laughs> and then the door just like swung open. They were ready. Holly rushed her three month old son Calvin to Helen DeVos Children's Hospital at the urging of her pediatrician. So we got there literally in the nick of time. They did all of these life saving measures. They shocked his heart twice. Calvin was born with a heart defect that caused one of his heart valves to malfunction. And within Less than five minutes of being there, he coded. A team of pediatric cardiologists worked on Calvin. We literally made it in the nick of time. We wouldn't have made a life flight to Ann Arbor, which would be the closest place that they would bring high-risk cases to. Calvin was put on a newly purchased heart-lung bypass machine to save his life. Helen DeVos Children's Hospital had only been open four years, and yet, its presence in West Michigan was already having an impact on families. So we're unbelievably lucky to have Helen DeVos so close. Especially because Calvin continues to have procedures for his heart, including open heart surgery, which he had last year. It's one of the reasons why Holly and her husband plan to stay in Grand Rapids. And we just can't leave it now. I mean, we've had opportunities to move and there's no way. If they're our family, like I, I couldn't imagine having to say goodbye and start over at another hospital or another place. To Holly and her family, Helen DeVos Children's Hospital is more than just a hospital. The family that we like got there and like how lucky we are to the hospital to be right there. I love you. Um, I like we just can't put into words. Because the staff accommodates even the littlest things, like allowing Calvin's friend Hobbs to be there by his side through every surgery. They even have matching scars to prove it. Can you show her his scar? Oh, he has a scar too? Hobbs does too. Are you going to show yours too? Oh, Hobbs look got at special that. Too, so they match because he was can getting see jealous. It? I can see it. <laughs> Here you go. It's okay. It's a little camouflage. <laughs> Such <laughs> sweet laughter. They gave us him back, you know? That Holly gets to hear every day because of Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. Whew, if that doesn't get you worked up. Wow, Val, that was Val reporting and uh, Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. It's not done growing. They are currently working on adding a pediatric heart transplant program and developing genetics research to help continue the fight against life threatening childhood diseases. We are so lucky to have that facility right here in West Michigan.